Hi, my in phase uh, envoy gateway system, it stopped communicating today. I think it was about, according to the data, about like 1am this morning or something. And I just repowered the whole thing, both the main inverter switch and the envoy. I just restarted that. Um, when I got here, it was uh, one, the top lead was solid red. Now I think that's usually solid green. Uh, so yeah, there's something like it's not it's not connecting. I think that's a cloudy symbol. So the top one there. So I'm not sure what's going on. I haven't changed the. Uh, this is Wi-Fi connected. I haven't changed the Wi-Fi at all. I don't know why is it four LEDs flashing like that continuously. I'll leave it for a few more minutes, but uh, yeah, I'm not liking this at all. I didn't touch it. Um, the internet's working. Uh, everything else is working fine. My other solar um, system, the solar assistant and the uh, DI is working just fine. But uh, this thing, I don't know. I haven't checked uh, to see if it's actually producing anything. I have to do that via uh, the solar analytics system, but I don't know, it's not booting. Turn off the Envoy again. So I switched off the Envoy, but the main switch is on. And then turn on the Envoy. We get four flashing red LEDs. What the heck? I mean, I just had a microinverter failed last week. Don't tell me the Envoy's failed. This is ridiculous. All right. I thought this was fixed and it wasn't going to be a thing. What I did was, uh, <laughs> hello IT, have you tried turning it off and on again? Um, uh, that's literally what I did. I tried turning the uh, end phase system off and on multiple times, didn't do it. So I thought, oh, okay, I'll restart the uh, router, I'll repower the Wi-Fi router. So I did that and all of a sudden it came back and it was fine. So here is yesterday. So this is my Enphase uh, Enlighten thing. And uh, so it stopped at like 1am or something like that. So it stopped here. But uh, and then I fixed it at about five o'clock here because the uh, micro inverters um, were still actually producing power and actually collecting the data. Um, it, uh, it just read the backlog of data out and I got the full day's production data and I thought ah oh, that's it okay it's been connected to the wi-fi router forever and I don't know glitching the wi-fi matrix um and repower the router everything's fine even though I had no other internet um issues everything else worked fine but anyway that seemed to have fixed it and so I wasn't going to release this video um at all but um wah, 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 this morning um at no sorry last night again Last night, th there it is then, Enlighten did not receive data from the gateway at the expected report time, because it reports every 15 minutes. Uh, check the gateway, I think it's every 15. Check the, uh, it is connected to the internet and reporting to Enlighten. So that's at, at 10.30 last night. So it lasted less than a day, and now it's screwed up again. What the heck's going on? I've never had a communications Wi-Fi issue and I haven't touched the Wi-Fi router I've got a, a big 8 antenna Wi-Fi -E, super duper power uh, Wi-Fi router thing and I've never had I've never had an issue with it even with my old even before I replaced it with a super duper high power Wi-Fi router I never had an issue with my old little one that had a little internal patch antenna or something I've never had an issue like this but it's gone down again Again, and unfortunately, I can't tell if it's actually producing power short of actually going there and putting a current clamp on the on the actual um, wire coming from there because I've got my solar analytics here, but you can see my solar analytics here is is matching uh, the produced is matching the consumed because as you can see here, everything is going into my battery. Right, the solar is producing here and it's going into the battery. Um, but of course, this is only the one for the DI inverter. So this doesn't know about the N phase inverter. I've got the AC coupling feature. It's complicated. I've got the AC coupling feature on to AC couple the N phase stuff into the battery. Um, so I don't know. Uh, well, actually, no, I could. Hang on. 
No, I just figured out 700, uh, 8, 800 watts is very dark and overcast out there at the moment. It is currently uh, 8.55 a.m. there. So let's say 800 watts. So how much is producing? Because it doesn't have a graph for the AC couple side, I don't think. So um, what's it producing at the moment? It's producing 650 PV power plus the auxiliary, which is 79. What's that? <laughs> 315 uh, plus, get the confuser out, 302 plus, just don't want to do this in my head and get it wrong, so 95. 712, and that's what we, uh, 762. Uh, uh, okay, are we getting a bit of AC coupling coming from, but I'd expect more because I've got the same number of solar panels. Um, in fact, the end phase ones are in a better location than these ones because they're higher up on the roof. They're higher up on the peak of the roof. So I'm not, not that it matters at the moment. It's completely overcast. So the sun's scattering everywhere. So it's, you know, um, what little sun there is. Uh, it's hard to tell, yeah, because I, I rely on my end phase system to tell me what the end phase is producing. So yeah, it's failed to communicate again. This is like, I just had a micro inverter fail and now I've had an end phase um, enlighten, oh, not an enlighten fail, what's it called? The, the gateway thing. Like I can go over here, right? Live, live status over here and it'll try and connect to the gateway and it won't, it won't. Normally that pops up immediately. Right? It should eventually say that I've come a gutsa. Yeah, you've come a gutsa. <laughs> I'm not going to try again because here, this is my microinverter, which has failed to report. Um, Enphase haven't um, contacted me, although I haven't contacted them directly. I've only um, contacted them via uh, Twittery slash X. Status, the, the gateway over here says it's operating normally, but so this is the Envoy S meter, the EU model. Why don't I have an AU model? Um, software version, I presume, because it's always connected to the internet, I presume it always keeps updating themselves. Is there a new firmware update that's causing this to come a gutsa? I don't know. There, There is an event view here somewhere. Let me try and find it. Let's go to a different view over here because you have this more complicated one and then you have this more consumery one, which is really weird. Anyway, um, system, event history. Um, I don't know why, uh, maybe I can get that from the other screen, but I, anyway. So 5, 524. So this is last night. This is last night when I fixed it, but there's no more, there's no report of an issue at 10.30 last night that it lost it. So, ah. Uh, what the heck's going on with my end phase? And it's not because there's no solar power being produced onto the uh, micro inverter. You know, there's very little sun out there at the moment. It's not that. Even if there's no sun at all, it, even during the night, it continues to report every 15 minutes or whatever because it's it's mains powered. This um, uh, Envoy S system is mains powered. So it should work. So I don't know. Anyone, any end phase people out there, let me know if you've had an issue like this, because I've I've never had this. It's it's just always worked. So I don't know what the heck is going on here. I'm just getting no data at all. Look, I can't I can't see any data on these at all, right? So I can go in here and view this graph. This is 7:15. Okay, so yeah, so that that was yesterday. That was Friday. Today's Saturday. So yeah, 7.15, that microinverter, 7.15 p.m., that microinverter stopped producing power last night, which is fantastic. Um, but yeah, have not heard from it since because there's no access on the gateway. What the heck is going on? Why has my end phase system suddenly decided, to, uh, A, a microinverter's died, and now B, my en Envoy S system is screwed up and is not reporting? This really sucks. So anyway, if I had decent solar power out there, I'd be able to go, go and measure some things and and um, figure out what's what's going on. But yeah, I don't know. This sucks. I'll keep you updated. Catch you next time.